Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Black and White. On the last episode, we took care of all the Plasma Grunts in Pinwheel Forest and in this episode. I have something special that I want to show you guys. Now, when this game first came out, I tried so freaking hard. So freaking hard to stay completely spoiled free. The only thing that I ever wanted to see was the starters. And the moment I saw Oshawa, I knew I fell in love. But at the exact same time, I did get spoiled about this area coming up. And this area means so much to me. So, as we go across this area, I will like to talk about why this area is special to me. Before we go on, got a quick claw. All right. Now, when Black and White was coming out, I was losing interest in the Pokemon franchise. I th thought that the adventures were too samey. Nothing held my grasp, kind of like how Crystal did when I first played through it. And then I saw this. This bridge got me so interested in this game. The fact that they went ham on this bridge. They just completely were just like, hey, let's throw in like this most ridiculous big ass like bridge for no other reason than what we can. And the fact that it's, well, it's name or like this is supposed to be I believe the Manhattan Bridge mainly because the area that we're about to go into is gonna be Manhattan because of this bridge I actually Got back into Pokemon, like, hardcore. Welcome, everybody, to Castalia City. This area is huge. Now, when I say huge, I mean it is fucking humongous. There, you, can't, you can't walk anywhere without being like, hey, there's shit to do. So, depending on what you answer, you can either get a fire, grass, or water stone. Um, I don't have any answer for that because I believe my team mainly evolves. Or the one, Cotney evolves via sunstone, so it's kind of uh, pointless. Now, we could just beeline it straight to the, to the gym and fight the gym there. Um, it's not you, right? No. Let's see. Except this. You'll notice there is a lot of ports in this city. There's one specific one that I want to go to. There it is. Okay. Oh. I need to be able to activate the event. Never mind. 
right? Unless it's on this one and I'm just dumb. I think I'm just dumb. No. I need to be able to activate the event. <sighs> okay, so... This gym's gonna be scary, I'm not gonna lie. It's gonna be... Gonna be kinda scary. This is not the gym. Gym is over here. Hey Harley, I just challenged the uh, gym leader. He's a seasoned gym leader. He made me work for that gym badge. But for me, bug type Pokemon aren't much of a challenge. I'm gonna keep winning like this until all of Unova's region's gym leaders. And then I'll head for the Pokemon uh, Pokemon League and outperform the champion. If I do that, everyone will admit what a strong trainer I am. That will make me feel truly alive. What, no? Oh, hello, Berg. Aha, you're the one that fought Team Plasma in the forest. If I remember, your name is Harley. Come to uh, challenge the gym, I suppose. Aw, oh, sorry, but could you wait a bit? I was informed that Team Plasma has shown up. In fact, come with me. I'm gonna go to the dock at Premier, er, Premier Pier. this way team plasma uh, they took this young lady's Pokemon is there anything we could do my Muna team plasma took it I heard this lady scream and I came running after the thief as fast as I could but this city is so big and so crowded I'm afraid I lost them iris did you uh, you did everything you could but that's so bad taking people's Pokemon is really bad because it's really nice when people and Pokemon are together. They have each other. Uh, they have something the other doesn't. They help each other. Iris. Agreed. No fear. We'll get that Pokemon back. Right, Harley? Yeah. Having said that, finding the person or a Pokemon here in Castellia City will be like finding a needle in a haystack. I spy a gym leader. Last time went so well, I thought I'd grab another Pokemon. Rethinking. I need to get out of here. Harley, let's go. Iris, you stay by that young lady's side. I'm gonna be Bianca's bodyguard, so it, you go after those bad guys. Okay? Uh, I honestly do not recall where they went. Well, I think it's the far side nearest the gym. Uh, uh, I just followed where Berg was. That way. Mm hmm. They're heading toward the gym. Past the gym, but yeah.
This is definitely the place. No one's here, not a soul. No other Team Plasma members, nor any of the seven sages are inside. If you think I'm lying, why don't you have a little battle and find out? I had a thought. We take care of this weak looking runt so you could show off by handling that tough looking guy over there. Oh please, Harley, I'll leave that one to you. Alright, so I taught Cotney a new move. It's an actual attacking move. Don't know why it has 10 out of 20, but hey, whatever. I haven't used it in battle yet. I just also realized that I, <laughs> I was going to go into the gym without even <laughs> stocking up. I'm so, I'm so dumb. Phew, we got lost. Even with directions from the X transceiver, I couldn't figure it out. Team Plasma's inside. The stolen Pokemon may be in there as well. Okay, I'm going in. Okay, this time I'll join the fight. Come on, Bianca, you too. Wait, wait, Harley, you come too. Uh, no shit. Three of the sages here. My word, if it isn't the gym leader, Berg. So what would you say is the guiding principle of Team Plasma anyway? Take what you want from people? I thought it would be amusing to prepare a hideout right in front of a Pokemon gym, but we were detected more quickly than I imagined. Indeed. No matter. We already have an exceptional base of operations. Is everyone familiar with the legend of the founding of the Unova region? I am. It's the black, black dragon type Pokemon, right? The truth is this. The black dragon appeared for, uh, before a hero who sought the ideal, we, ideal we, way to knit together a world full of warring people. This black dragon type Pokemon shared its knowledge and bared its fangs at those who stood against it. Together, the power of this Pokemon and, its, and the hero brought unity to the hearts of everyone in the land. That is how Unova was created. We shall bring the hero, uh, bring back the hero and that Pokemon to Unova once again. If we can win people's hearts and minds, we can easily create that the world that I, <laughs> I mean Team Plasma, desires. Here in Castilia, we have a lot of different kinds of people. Everyone's way of thinking and lifestyle are very different. Honestly, there's something about what you're saying that I don't quite understand. One thing that we all have in common is that we all care a lot about Pokemon. Even people meeting for the first time can talk about Pokemon. Talk or battle or trade. Remember your speech at Akumo Town? You were responsible for leading me to rethink my relationship with Pokemon. For that, I thank you. 
At that time, I made a promise. I swore to myself that I would dedicate myself to Pokemon even more strongly. What you guys are doing, aren't you going to strengthen the bond between people and Pokemon even more? <laughs> You're quite uh, hard to figure out. A little more intelligent than I expected. I am fond of intelligent people. You see, you'll enjoy hearing about this. From every corner of the world, I have gathered knowledgeable people for our king's benefit. You would call them the Seven Sages. Very well, we will submit to your opinion and be on our way. That girl over there, return her Pokemon. Th thank you. Mooney, I'm so glad to see you again. Bianca, why are you thinking them? They take people's precious Pokemon. It's just, I'm just so happy that my Muna is safe. The friendship between Pokemon and people can be very touching. But in order to liberate Pokemon from foolish people, receive, we will receive the legend of Unova and win the hearts and minds of everyone. Farewell. What are you doing? Why are you letting them get away? Gah. What do we do if there's if anything's happened to the other stolen Pokemon? It's okay, thank you, Iris. No one was hurt. More than anything, I got my darling Pokemon back again. Okay, if you're happy. What is everyone planning to do now? Oh, would it be sensational? It would be sensational to look around Castelli City, but. Don't worry, I'll keep on being your bodyguard. Iris. Mm-hmm, that's great. Iris is a dazzling Pokemon trainer, but maybe not at home in the big city yet. So a little give and take, hmm? People and Pokemon need to help each other out. Also, thanks for looking for the Pokemon. Here, this is for you. A Yetchi Berry, which I don't recall what that does. See you. Wait! Well then, Harley, I'll be waiting in the gym. What does the Yetchi Berry do? I forget it. We can super effective ice type attacks against the holding Pokemon. Man, I wonder what kind of Pokemon she trains. The smoke ball, how apt. Uh, let's see. Well, I don't want it to be so soon, but I do have work today, so I can't continue to record. But tomorrow I should be recording even more. Let's see. Alright guys, thank you all so much for coming down and watching. Don't forget to enjoy the rest of your weekend. Till next time, stay safe out there. And next time we will have some special things to do here. Alright guys, thank you all so much for watching. <laughs> Bye.